Being injured in an accident is no joke, especially when it happens to you or someone you love. Thank you for calling. You phoned because you've been injured in an accident. You have questions about your rights and benefits. If you have questions about your legal rights as an accident victim, call 742-8700 and listen. No obligation, just information. Call Know Your Rights, 742-8700, sponsored by the law offices of Paris, Pomeroy, and Pomacato. I work for a radio station, but I'm also a member of Channel 7's New England News Exchange. That may sound confusing, but it's all part of their new team approach. You see, to them, it doesn't matter who gets credit for breaking a story. What matters is that the information is clear, accurate, and interesting to their viewers. That's the nice thing about Channel 7. They don't want the glory. They just want the story. The New England News on Channel 7. We're all on the same team. Hi, I'm Susan Zakora. If your life seems to be filled with stress right now, maybe you need to get away from it all and go somewhere you can relax, rejuvenate, and recover. In fact, maybe you should try one of the many spas around the country rather than settling for an ordinary vacation. At a spa, you'll eat right, get the kind of exercise you need, and receive the kind of pampering you deserve. Life at a Spa, Monday at 10.30 on Morning Live. I hope you'll join us. Massachusetts is rich in cultural attractions. Theater, music, museums. I'm lucky. With my job, I don't always have to pay full price to enjoy these things, but you do. You can change that. Call this number and receive this. It's the Massachusetts Cultural Coupon Booklet. Free. Inside, you'll find $200 worth of discounts for 34 different cultural attractions across the state. So come on, share the common wealth at a discount. You'll feel good about that. Daddy, what's Vietnam? What's Vietnam? A question a child might ask, but not a childish question. A question that in the past has led not to answers, but only to other questions. What were we fighting for? Why didn't we just drop the bomb? How could we fight an enemy we couldn't even see? Did all those people die? Time Life Books and Boston Publishing present The Vietnam Experience. The series designed to answer the nagging questions. Did we win the war, Daddy? Each volume looks at the war from every point of view. No matter where you stood, you'll gain new insights into your own position, as well as those you may have opposed. You'll attend secret meetings at the White House and walk into an ambush to draw enemy fire. From Quezon to Chicago to Saigon, you'll be there, learning much you didn't know about Vietnam and much you didn't know about America. Why did we fight the war, Daddy? Call toll-free and start putting the Vietnam experience into focus with Combat Photographer. You'll see what it was like over there from a perspective the media couldn't provide. An historic perspective that only now are we able to consider. It is important that we honor and remember those who gave their lives for our country. But honoring isn't enough. Remembering isn't enough. We must answer the question, what's Vietnam for ourselves? and for the next generation. Will I have to fight in a war, Daddy? To order your first book, call now, 1-800-626-1300. It'll be sent to you free for 10 days. Keep it and pay just $14.95 plus shipping and handling. Others will follow about one every other month. Keep the ones you want, cancel any time. So call 1-800-626-1300. As a newspaper man, I don't have many good things to say about television. But I couldn't refuse when Channel 7 asked me to join the New England News Exchange. Now, when something happens in my area, I've got two ways to tell people about it. My typewriter and their camera. Of course, I still don't have many good things to say about television. Except when I'm on it. The New England News on Channel 7. We're all on the same team. This year, as many as 1.5 million Americans will suffer heart attacks. Research shows that heart attack victims who receive bystander-initiated CPR have a survival rate of up to five times higher than those who don't. So don't just stand there. Does anyone know what to do? 
Call this number and find out where to get CPR training in your community. Call now, because there's no such thing as an innocent bystander. The streets. For too many kids, it's a place to play. A place to learn. The wrong place. It's where they go when there's nowhere else to go. I know. I'm Telly Savalas. And I was one of these kids. But I got lucky. I found a place to learn, to play. A place where people care. It's your local boys club. The boys club is a place where kids learn what it takes to be somebody. Where they learn the meaning of teamwork and responsibility. And discover they can believe in themselves. The boys club is people. People who care. And they could use a hand right now and it's yours, baby. The club that beats the streets, your local boys club. Support the boys clubs in New England. This year in greater Boston, record numbers of people are looking for homes. Location isn't important. Parking isn't essential. They aren't going to be picky about the view. They are the homeless. Men, women, and children who more than ever need the help of the United Way. With 59 of our agencies providing aid and shelter, we're a solution to a problem that is getting too big to cover up. If you want to do more, give more. The people, the places, the learning, the adventure, the world is waiting. Be an exchange student. Write Youth Exchange, Pueblo, Colorado, 81009. Here in this land of plenty, about 10 million people are hungry. Many don't know they're eligible for food stamps. Most are family people going through some temporary troubles. They've lost a job, a farm, or a husband. Food stamps can help. You don't have to be in public assistance. You can have a job and still qualify. Now one phone call can get you information to tell you if you qualify for food stamps and how to get them. America has made a place at our table of plenty for you. We want to make sure you get there. Call for a free brochure. 1-800-453-4000. Food stamps. Meal times don't have to be tough times. My parents always say it's really tough to raise kids today. They say that we grow up too fast and we're just not the same as they were. They say things were better when they were young. They just don't understand what's happening. And neither do I. One thing all kids have in common today is the challenge of growing up. Campfire programs bring kids together to meet that challenge. Now with our special line that explains campfire, a kid can talk to somebody who really understands another kid.